Okay. I'm not sure which one of these. I forgot I got this plump one. And the other one I got is a flower. Look at it. It's so glitzy. Now, flower makeup is um, a Drew Barrymore brand. And I have been looking for it. I'm in Tucson, Arizona. Let me know where you're from down in the comments. But in my area, I only found one or two hard candy things. And this is the first flower makeup I've been able to find. And I asked about it. No one knows. No, no one knows anything, okay? They don't know when it's coming in or what they're ordering. I think they just get stuff. You think they order certain things. Now this is Oh my gosh, I should have my glasses. Milky Way. I don't know why it'd be called Milky Way. Maybe because of all the glitter. It's like stars. Okay, I want to see what this is like. It's light. I can tell you that. You know how a lot of lipsticks are heavy? Um... It's kind of a pretty color. And it has a little glitter in it. I don't know if you can tell. I mean, I know it, it's shiny, but... Wow. I really like it. Oh. Huh. Yeah. I can feel the bits of glitter. I can't feel them when I do this. My lips seem really smooth. Now, yeah. no taste, no smell. I like it. I might put this one back on. But let's see this one. Now, this one's supposed to be a plumper. And it's LA Colors. And they had a couple different ones the other day when I went in I didn't get them and then today this was the only color they had left but it's a pretty color I think it's a dark <laughs> but especially for this time of year I'm not feeling any tingle yet Well, this is a good color for the holidays, too. I like it. That is going to be... I don't know. I'll have it on my teeth. Yeah, I like this color, too. All right, well... I'm going to actually leave this on for a few minutes. I'm not feeling any tingle and I'm not feeling any plumping. But I'm going to leave it on. Just let's see what happens. Mm. Yeah. I like the color. I like both of them. Win-win. <laughs> okay. Now I also got this. My little guy ate them. They're the teriyaki beef jerky. And today I was there, the Jack Links. And you only get, um, I think it says six ounce, but um, you don't get much in there. But for a dollar in the store, I can't find them for under about five dollars. So and I think you get maybe a half a pound or a pound for that. I don't know. It's a bigger bag in the store for sure. But um, comparison, I don't know. 
No. I... Hi, baby. My little guy's not feeling good, but baby, you're not eating this why? I love you. Okay, so... Um, yeah, I'd like to find some more of that flower. But, anyway, I got one of these because, actually, I probably should have got two. I got a red one. It's just for the the um, wreath, you know, to hang a wreath on the door or a sign or whatever. Um, we have one, and I had asked my sister, because she makes the wreaths usually, if she needed more, and she goes, she can always use more, so I got her that. And then I got this. Now, this is adorable. And I almost got some red glitter there. They have little bottles of glitter. And what I was looking for were the wooden stars that were hanging down like four or five stars. And they didn't have them. So I have to keep looking for them. They must have sold a lot out. Because I wanted to hang like probably four or five across the window in the living room just hanging down. And I was going to decorate them with, I was going to put um, glitter or something, paint them and put glitter on them. But anyway, so these are cute. These are a three-dimensional little scenery. And they have several kinds. I did take pictures. I'm going to try to post those pictures. I'm having a really hard time with my camera or, or my computer. I have two computers now. So my other computer was, um, this one was being repaired. My other computer, I was using it and I tried to do voiceover on it the other day and it wouldn't do it. And I don't know why. Okay, so it comes with this plank and that's what you set these in. <clears throat> So I'm going to put this one in the back since it's the tallest. And then you can put the house in here. So it's like that. You can move it wherever you want. You want it in the middle, you can put it there. Then you can put the little tree. You can put the presents, the candy canes. So anyway, you put them wherever you want. There's the three rows. And they had, uh, they had a nativity. They had a, isn't that beautiful? Now the tree, see how it's done in green? I think if you did the candy canes and you did the package and you painted or glittered, they would look really cute. Um, they had Santa and they had uh, gingerbread. So anyway, those were really cute. I mean a dollar. Look at that. I mean just all those wood cutouts for a dollar. Honestly. You know, you have one, two, three four, five, six counting this pieces for a dollar. I, I don't know. And I did want to bring up the subject of the Dollar Tree race and their prices. Just like that. A dollar. How could they do it? And they are coming out with more and more great things. And yes, I would love everything to stay a dollar. And, you know, I remember when gas was less than a dollar a gallon. So I would love everything to be less than a dollar. But if it means that they will continue to come out with wonderful things in comparison to name brand and a lot of name brand things, then I am giving them a thumbs up. I know for the stores, the one I went to tonight, I know they didn't have their lights on outside, their big Dollar Tree lights. I've managed a lot of restaurants and um, businesses, and I know that bottom line dollars, you know, it's like your house, your budget. Y you have to adjust. 
uh, turn lights off or conserve or your groceries, you know, whatever it is. We all budget. And in a business, you have to budget. And I, when they get done paying their help, and I don't know how they do it. I, I don't know how. Now, the more they can sell, I mean, I think people doing YouTube videos help them probably in a lot of ways because people see the, the merchandise and they can buy it. The more they sell, the more they can produce. But um, I feel like I'd rather have them around and have to maybe pay a little more than have them go under like so many businesses have done and not be able to get these great great things and with the green briar products that are coming out with the crafter's square and the juncture and all the green briar items i think they're doing a fantastic job and i hope they continue to be successful okay that being said, I'm going to show you the next item. This is another Christmas thing. They had um, a snowman and a reindeer. And they might have had an elf. But this is great. You hang it up. You start on December 1. And this, this would be great for a classroom or uh, people with kids. You can hang that up and every day they can move the little sticky to the next day until we get down there. So I thought that was cute. And it's just felt pieces, but you figure one, two, I mean, there, there must be 20 felt pieces on here. You know, the eyes and the mustache and the beard and the hands and the fuzz on the hands and the hat and the little ball these are all individual pieces another thing a dollar dollar tree that's cute and i hadn't seen it until today so and then I got this. Every year they have different ones. And they had gold ones. And they had red and green. And they had silver. But um, anyway, I like this one with a little poinsettia on it. I like to put these on the door handles. Whether it's the front door or the back door or the bedroom or the bathroom or whatever. Just little, uh, you know, jingle bells for the holiday. I love, uh, I love the jingle bells. So... I, I know I have one or two of these already, so I'll just add to it. And then there was this. And I'm going to show you they had a Christmas tree, a snowman, a red truck, and um, they had this one. And what it is, now they had some of these, these just metal container or um, stand-ups they had uh, last week, but they were a little bit different. This one has those cutouts, and it actually has a place for a tea light. And uh, so that will be another thing glowing at Christmas in our house. Put a little tea light back there. Uh, we have um, those, those battery-operated ones that they sell. And uh, that's just another one we can put in. But I thought that was cute. And if I can get, I'll, I'll post, I did take pictures of the other ones, but I can get it to work. I'll post them up. Now these ornaments I hadn't seen before either. These are so cute. I think they're supposed to be like cookie ornaments that you make. But they had different ones. They had... Um, gingerbread and you know the typical but this is our little Nomi look at him and the candy cane so it's two ornaments and they're thick you know they're they're like um, I'm assuming they're like a rubber or a 
Yeah, they're like a rubber, but there's I think they're supposed to look like a cookie. You know how you make those cookie ornaments. And I just thought that was so cute. They keep every time I go there they have a do you know me. You know, they have the cups and the the these that I got a couple of weeks ago that I had shared already with you and um they had a bunch of them, but um, I thought these were just adorable for the tree. Now the other kinds they have, I may I may get them too. It's kind of hard. You don't want to miss out on the Christmas stuff, but on the other hand, it's like I have so many things to do before Christmas, you know, and so I. I, it's hard for me to go and spend a lot of money with Christmas when I'm still worried about Halloween and Thanksgiving, but you don't want to miss out and they'll be gone. So, um, I did buy those like the snowflakes. I missed out unless they come out again with them. So you want to get them. They had a lot of paper. They had a lot of big gift bags. They had a lot of for Christmas. They had a lot of wrapping paper and they had some really nice foil paper. And, uh, but I, I almost bought some and I thought, no, I'm going to wait. Uh, I'm going to wait just a little bit on that. Let me see. I did get a couple more things. Oh, this might be the last thing. And I don't know if anyone's tried this, but it's the aroma booster and um, someone had said that they thought and these are different colors I don't know if I can show you there are some pink and white and green Anyway, they smell wonderful. So you can put them just in a sachet in the bathroom or you can use them in your laundry. Um, they, they really smell good. When I went around the corner, a really good smell. And somebody had told me that they think that maybe they're, um, they're from the, the boosters that they have. The name brand ones that um, maybe the defective ones or the ones that just aren't shaped perfectly. Um, but they smell wonderful. So I thought I'd give it a try. Now I have to tell you, I did buy the Ajax. I, I bought both brands. I've only used one of them. And I normally use Gain or Tide. And those were Ajax. I personally don't feel like they are as good. They, yes, they're a good deal. And yes, if you use Ajax uh, detergent, then they're probably fine. But um, for me, I, I, my clothes just looked a little dingy. Um, and I don't get that with Gain or Tide. And Tide... Tide is my, you know, gain. I love the smell, but Tide is, for me anyway, Tide just is, you know, the thing that really brings the colors out in my clothes and brightens them. And I don't have that dingy, dingy uh, color. But anyway, they are a great deal. And I'll use them. And I use them for many things anyway. Sometimes I just put one or two in the in the toilet at night, swish it around and leave it and let it do its thing. Um, so there's many things to use them for. And I will try the other brand and update you. Um, maybe it'll be better. Um, but the one kind I got didn't didn't work so well of the Ajax. So Anyway, I mean, I cleaned my clothes, but just, you know, I thought I'd let you know. Because, truth. I like to tell the truth in how things go. And, um, this lipstick 
I don't feel it plumped and I never felt it tinging, tingling. But that being said, it feels good. I like the color and uh, it was a dollar, <laughs> you know, and uh, yeah, I like it. So if you're looking for it to plump, anyway, maybe just the one I got isn't working, but um, yeah. So that being said, you all have a wonderful night or day and I will see you back here on the next video. Bye bye. All right, here we go. Here is the reindeer, like my Santa calendar and the ornaments, the Santa, the penguin, the elf and the candy canes. And then we have the gingerbread and the candy cane. And then also the tea lights with the red truck, the Santa, the snowman and the Christmas tree. Okay, guys, hope you have a great night. See you later.